Ethics in business pertains to the principles of honesty, fairness to relationships, employees, co-workers, customers, vendors, government entities, partners, and the general public. High ethical standards in business and professions. The recognition of the worthiness of all useful occupations and dignifying by each Rotarian of their occupation is an opportunity to serve society. So as you can see, worldwide, Rotary's second principal objective is business ethics. We have been honoring successful organizations within our community who embrace the spirit of Rotary's ethical vision with the hope of encouraging others to do the same. So we welcome you all and thank you for being at this year's event. Now it's with great honor that the Rotary Club of Golden presents a prestigious Ethics in Business Award to a for-profit and a not-for-profit organization. The nominees are individuals and organizations that exemplify high ethical standards in all their dealings and customers, beneficiaries, employees, suppliers, donors, and with their community as a whole. So what are you willing to give your life for? What would you trade your life for? That's a question that we don't often wrestle with because I think it's a question that makes us a little bit uncomfortable. Do you know in this world today that half the world's population, three billion with a B billion people, live on about $2.50? We have so much abundance that we throw it in the garbage. If you're running an organization today and you haven't figured this out, now is the time. The people that work with us and work for us are giving to you and to me the most precious asset that they have, and that's their energy, their intelligence, their time. And what our job is as leaders of these organizations is to marry up what they're doing, the what, with the purpose of why. That's what we get to do. Am I passionate about this? If you're in a job and you haven't tapped into passion and purpose, quit. You're never going to be much good at it. And I promise you, you will not be happy because it doesn't touch your heart. Whatever you want to call it, there's this notion. It is a law of nature, just the same as gravity, that what you put out there comes back. What if? We set our lodestar, our passion, our purpose on stewardship. Schweitzer said this. He said, I don't know what your destiny will be, but I know that the only ones among you who will ever be truly happy are those who seek and find ways to serve other people. This notion of a one word ethics statement, service, it might actually work. It might be revolutionary. It might just change this whole little town. I don't know what your destiny will be, but this one thing I do know, the only ones among you who will ever be truly happy are those who seek and find ways to serve other people. And God bless you on your quest. And in the not-for-profit, the winner is Foothills Animal Shelter, Jennifer Strickland. In the for-profit category, the winner is Cody Flooring and Tile, Steve Barrow. Rotary International also stands on a foundation of ethical principles. We are guided in our everyday activities by a four-way test of the things we think, say, or do. These principles are first, is it the truth? Second, is it fair to all concerned? Third, will it build goodwill and better friendships? And fourth, will it be beneficial to all concerned? Uh, have a great Friday and drive safely.